We currently have around uh, between 10 and 30 tonnes of food, depending on the time of year, uh, all given to us by donations by individuals or corporates locally. Um, we cover an area from Chichester, Southsea, Midhurst and Petworth, so quite a large area with the four food banks that we supply uh, from the main warehouse here. Um, at the moment uh, we have yourself, Seaford College, supporting us to um, provide um, at least 250 each, each holiday, which is a great help, but we really would love to have other schools involved. Even if they can only make 10 during a holiday, those 10 would be a great help. Every box counts, every donation, every tin we have really makes a difference. The KLPs are a box of food that are given to uh, parents uh, prior to the holidays that they would register for. Um, the box is an additional supply of food during the holidays where a family would normally be eligible for a free school lunch but there's no lunch obviously because school isn't taking place in the holidays so Easter, summer and Christmas holidays we would provide the KLPs. We have Easter coming up, we're making a thousand for Easter so they will be distributed around Chichester, will be around 550, Midhurst and Petworth will be another couple of hundred and then Selsey a smaller amount as well. This is our kids lunch pack, this is being packed for Easter 2023. Um, in it we have a selection of cereals, milk, tinned products like tinned fish, baked beans, meat, vegetables, soup, uh, ham, biscuits and treats, tea, fruit, lots of uh, lovely things to help fill up the store cupboard. We also have a small note saying to the parents this, this box will last you about 10 days and what we suggest you know, is suitable for a meal. Um, and then we also put information cards in so if the families are struggling there are other contacts there that they can um, contact for some further advice. Um, if families are also struggling during the holidays they can apply for one of our vouchers to have a full food bank parcel. Yep, we do certainly cater for special dietary requirements. On the registration list there are the options that we could uh, leave out or add in further items as needed. So within these boxes, these are standard boxes, um, making up a thousand boxes, uh, 900 of them would be standard and I would estimate about a hundred that would be special dietary. So that could be vegetarian, lactose free, nut free, fish free, halal, gluten-free, all, all available to order on the when you actually register. So all feasible if there are any special dietary requirements and allergies. So since the pandemic, we have seen the demand raised by about 20%. So um, eligibility currently in the area is about two and a half thousand children for a free school lunch. Um, and we're seeing a take up of about a thousand 1200 per holiday. So the criteria would be that they would be um, having a free school lunch. Um, our registration system goes through that with them online. Donations for KLPs, if a school is helping out, we would suggest they fundraise and then they can buy the given list of items for the box and then pack the things at school. Children can get involved, be a great help to see how they can give back.